Well, I just thought, seeing as neither of us can go with who we'd really like to, we should go together as friends. Why didn't I think of that? Who are you going with? Um, it's a surprise. Anyway, it's you we've got to worry about. You can't just take anyone. See that girl over there? That's Ramilda Vane. Apparently she's trying to smuggle you a love potion. Really? Hey, she's only interested in you because she thinks you're the chosen one. But I am the chosen one. OK, sorry. Um, kidding. There's a new Harry Potter film in town, Harry Potter and the Half-Blood Prince. It's number six in the series, and a lot of the talk around it has been that this is a dark film. And to a certain extent, that's true. This is a film that details the rise of the Death Eaters, the followers of the incredibly evil Voldemort. And they seem to be on the ascendancy, and that casts a little bit of a darkness over the film. But really, this film is not a dark film. This is as comfortable and familiar as an old shoe. This is Hogwarts we're talking about. It's Dumbledore. What could be safer? There's been a lot of talk recently that Dumbledore's got a bit old. What rubbish. Well, he's only... What is he? 150? Give or take a few years. <laughs> This is very similar to the other Harry Potter films. They're all about craft, they're all about consistency, they're all about fidelity to the original source of the novels. So if you like the other Harry Potter films, this one will be for you. If you've never seen a Harry Potter film, you're better off going to the beginning. Shut it! For the Los Angeles Times, this is Kenneth Turan.